Okay, today we're going to talk a little bit more about what do insects do in the winter. And do you see that right there? Looks like a cotton ball with a little bit of dirt in it. Well, that's one way that insects survive in the winter time. That's called a cocoon. And many butterflies, um, moths, and even some wasps will make a cocoon in the fall and they will survive in the winter. Now we know that um, those creatures then in the spring are going to hatch and climb out of there in their winged form. But how do they get to that place right there? Well, eggs are laid by the adult insects in the uh, springtime. And in the spring, those eggs turn into little grubs or caterpillars, and they chew themselves merrily all summer long and gorge on the green growing stuff that they love to eat. Then when fall comes, they spin themselves a beautiful, warm, cozy cocoon, just like the one we saw there. So what would you like to do? Spend the winter sleeping cozy, warm, in a nice, warm, wrapped up bed? Well, that's what they like to do all winter long. And then in the springtime, out comes a beautiful butterfly or a moth or a wasp. That's how these creatures survive the winter time. I want you to get outside and see if you can find some cocoons. They're not that hard to find. They're usually in sheltered spots, sometimes even under windows or on eavesdropping, on the outside of siding, check and see on trees, on twigs, uh, sometimes even just on the stems of plants you'll find some um, cocoons. So you need to have sharp eyes, but get out there and start looking and have fun. See you later. Woo!